Imagine standing at the edge of a big wavy sea. Countless challenges of life throw your way. It's really tough, like giant waves coming at you. But guess what? You're not alone with faith in God's words. You're like a brave sailor who can handle these big waves. We're gonna share stories about people who faced really hard stuff, but didn't give up because they believed in God and followed his teachings. It's like God's words are a special map and faith is your strong boat. Let's find out how they turn tough times into chances to grow stronger and feel closer to God. Have you ever faced challenges in life that seemed too great to overcome? Moments when despair weighed you down and hope seemed distant? In these trying times, it's all too easy to lose faith and succumb to doubt. But today, we want to remind you of the power of unwavering faith and the strength we find in God's Word. The Bible tells us that, with God, all things are possible. It's not just a saying. It's a truth that has stood the test of time. Through His Word, we can find comfort, guidance, and the unwavering strength to conquer any challenge we face. When we look at the wonders of creation, we see an incredible display of God's power and creativity. From the beautiful to the intricate details of a tiny flower, we are reminded that the same God who created all of this is with us, ready to help us overcome any obstacle. Stick around. You don't want to miss this powerful message that will change your life. Just as God's Word gives us strength, it teaches us valuable lessons in perseverance. It reminds us that this life's obstacles are not meant to break us, but to shape us into the individuals we are meant to be. With faith, we can turn every stumbling block to our growth and success. Philippians 4, 6 to 7. Don't worry about anything. Instead, in any situation, talk to God through prayer and ask Him for what you need while being thankful. When you do this, God's peace, which is beyond what we can understand, will protect your heart and thoughts because of Jesus Christ. Just like I experienced, life can be tough and make us feel anxious, but when we trust God and pray with a thankful heart, He promises to give us a special kind of peace during hard times. In prayer, we find solace, peace, and a deep connection with God. It is in these moments of communion that our faith is strengthened and our hearts find the courage to face any adversity. Let us never underestimate the power of prayer as we navigate the challenges of life. God's Word teaches us the greatest lesson of all, love. It reminds us to extend a helping hand to one another, to uplift and support each other through life's trials. Together, we can conquer challenges knowing that we are not alone. So, as you face your challenges today, remember the unwavering faith that resides within you. Draw strength from God's Word, seek solace in prayer, and show love and compassion to your fellow human beings. In this video, we talk about how a strong belief in God and His teachings helps us overcome tough times. Life throws many challenges our way, but when we truly believe in God's Word, we can beat any problem. We look at how solid faith changes our lives. Using lessons from Bible teachings, we learn how to face and defeat difficulties. Our faith gives us the strength, bravery, and persistence we need to get through hard times. We share inspiring stories of people who faced big problems and overcame them by trusting in God. These stories show how much we can achieve when we deeply connect with God. This message also gives useful tips on how to grow our faith by learning and using God's teachings. When we dive into these teachings, we gain helpful knowledge that prepares us to meet challenges and win. This motivational video encourages you to tackle your struggles with confidence, faith, and a strong belief in God. You'll see how believing in God's promises can change your life and give you hope, 
even when things are tough. Ephesians 6, 10 to 13. Stay strong with God's help and use his great strength. Wear all of God's protection so you can stay strong against the devil's tricks. We're not just fighting people, but also fighting against bad forces and spirits in places we can't see. Remember, your struggles are not just physical. They are spiritual challenges that need spiritual effort to beat. John 16, 33. I have told you these things so you can find peace in me. You will face problems in this world, but don't worry, I have conquered the world. As followers of Christ, we will face challenges in life. This doesn't mean something is wrong or that God has left us. In this verse, Jesus is telling us to be ready for tough times, but also to be brave because he is with us and because of what he did on the cross. Life has its troubles and conflicts, but with Jesus, you can find peace and get through them. Life can be tough, and it gets even harder when we face big problems. But even when things are tough, we have ways to get through them. I'm going to share with you God's words that help us overcome these hard times. As God's children, God's words will help you to face these challenges with faith in Jesus Christ. We don't have to rely on our power, but on the strength given by the Holy Spirit. Remember, like in any great story, there's always a challenge or a problem to solve. James 1, verses 2 to 4. Be happy, everyone, when you go through tough times. These challenges help your faith grow stronger. Keep going, because this helps you become more mature and, well, rounded without missing anything important. Listen to this story about a man named John, who faced many problems with his family. His relatives often argued, and there was little peace at home. John, busy with life's challenges, rarely read the Bible. He believed in God, but didn't make much time for his words. One night, something extraordinary happened. God spoke to John in a dream. It was a gentle yet powerful voice, urging him to seek solace and guidance in the Bible. The dream felt so real that John woke up feeling different, as if a new path had been shown to him. From that day, John started to meditate on the words of God. Each morning, he read a few verses, pondering their meaning and how they applied to his life. He sought to understand God's teachings, and as he did, his perspective on life began to change. He learned about patience, love, forgiveness, and understanding. These were not just words to him anymore. They became principles he strived to live by. John realized that many of his family problems were due to misunderstandings and lack of communication. He decided to apply what he learned to his interactions with his family. Slowly, John's family started noticing a change in him. He was calmer, more patient, and listened more. He didn't react angrily to provocations like he used to. Instead, he tried to understand the other person's viewpoint and find a peaceful solution. His family was surprised by his transformation. Inspired by John, they too began to change. Arguments became discussions, and misunderstandings were resolved through talking and understanding each other's perspectives. John's faith in God grew stronger each day. He felt a deep connection with the divine teachings and realized the power of faith in transforming not just himself, but also those around him. His family, once riddled with troubles, now found a new way of coexisting with love, patience, and understanding. The relatives, who once argued with each other, started to reconcile. They saw the positive changes in John and his immediate family and were inspired to make changes in their own lives. The family gatherings, which were once filled with tension, became occasions of joy and togetherness. John's journey wasn't easy. There were days when he doubted himself, but he held on to his faith. He remembered the dream and the voice of God, which kept him anchored. His dedication to understanding and living by the teachings of the Bible created a ripple effect, 
bringing peace and harmony to his family. In the end, John realized that the key to resolving his family's troubles lay in his transformation. By putting his faith in God and living by his teachings, he became a beacon of change and positivity. His family, once divided, was now united, all thanks to the power of faith and the wisdom found in the quiet moments of meditating on the Word of God. Remember, when hard times come, we can be joyful because these moments are a sign of God's love for us. They help us grow spiritually and bring us closer to Him. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for always being there for me, even when I forget to see it. I know there are times when I don't have as much faith in you as I should. I'm sorry for those moments when I doubt and don't trust you completely. Please forgive me for these times of weak faith. I realize now more than ever how important it is to have faith in you. You are the one who guides me through every challenge and joy in life. I ask for your help to remind me to always trust in you, especially during the tough times when I feel lost or scared. Help me to remember that you have a plan for me and that everything happens for a reason, even if I can't see it right away. I also ask for your guidance to make it a habit to meditate on your words every day. Your words are a light in my life, guiding me on the right path and giving me strength and hope. I want to make reading and thinking about your teachings a part of my daily routine. This way, I can keep my faith strong and always remember your love and goodness. I'm grateful for your endless love and patience with me. Even when I falter or lose my way, you are always there, waiting for me with open arms. Your love is a reminder of the beauty and goodness in the world. Help me to see your hand in everything around me and to feel your presence in every moment of my life. I know that with your help, I can face anything that comes my way with you by my side, I have nothing to fear. Please keep guiding me, strengthening my faith and helping me to trust in you with all my heart. I want to grow closer to you every day and to live my life according to your will. Thank you, God, for everything. I am forever grateful for your unwavering support and love. Amen. Thank you for watching. We hope this video has reminded you of the immense power within you and encouraged you to face your challenges head on with faith and strength. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more uplifting content. Write Amen in the comment section and like and share it with others to uplift them in the Lord. And join our community of believers supporting one another on this journey of faith. God bless you abundantly as you continue to overcome your challenges with unwavering faith and the strength found in His Word. Don't go anywhere. Watch another uplifting video next on the screen.